Moving on now, Inspector General of Police IGP Olukayo Deekbetokun has reiterated his commitment to prioritize the welfare of police officers. IGP Ogbetokun speaking in Abuja shortly before presenting checks to families of some diseased police personnel explained that the safety and well-being of officers who continue to serve and their, and their families remain a top priority of the current management of the force. Our correspondent Fumilola Adeyemi has details in this report. Over 15 billion has been disbursed to 5,225 family members and next of kings of slave police officers between 2023 and 2024. IGP Egberto Kun explained that the gesture was part of effort to sympathize with the families of the disease and also to upkeep their day-to-day -day life challenges. To the families of our fallen officers gathered here today, while we know we cannot fill the void left by the loss of your loved ones, we hope that these checks will provide some support as we face the challenges ahead. The IGP added that its leadership will enhance welfare packages for all members of the police family, irrespective of their status, and also create an environment where every officer feels valued, protected, and motivated to deliver his or her utmost in the service of the nation. As we honor our fallen heroes, we also renew our commitment to the safety and well-being of the officers who continue to serve. The current management of the force remains steadfast in its dedication to prioritizing the welfare of our personnel. Nigerian police force through the force insurance office, according to the IGP, explained that this event covers the balance payment of insurance policy for 2018 to 2024. Fumilala Adeyemi, ADBN News.